I believe in the green revolution. I believe in ecology. And one of the things I want to do is to see Abia Central, the greenest senatorial constituency in Nigeria. We're going to plant trees. We're going to establish parks, garden parks, in every local government in my, in my constituency, and so on. And then finally, I want to say, one of the things that is important to me is accountability. And I'm going to be accountable, just like I did in Poland, I am going to do here. Every three months, I am going to write a progress report of what I have done, those promises I have made, what has been achieved, what has not been achieved, why it has not been achieved, and the way forward. I believe that Nigeria is a wonderful country. Nigeria is a blessed country. Nigeria has the resources, the human capacity. We have everything, but we have poor leaders. Poor leaders. And I believe that this is the time for change. And I want to encourage my friends in the diaspora, those of you who are in the diaspora, please, if you're watching this, come back. Come back. I'm not telling you to leave your country, but at least make your presence felt in Nigeria. Because despite the fact that we might be good wherever we are, we have only one country. And that country is called Nigeria. Not too much about what is happening in the Senate. <laughs> what is happening in the Parliament. Why we are worried about the Nigerian Parliament and the entire ecosystem of our politics is that leadership has gone berserk. Our nation need a direction. Part of the problems in the National Assembly is that they lack the ability and the competence to do nation building. We need harmony to be able to move our direction, move our nation to a particular direction. But instead of trying to create the harmony, the national, people in the National Assembly are busy chasing contracts and chasing various other things that doesn't have to do with legislation. Try camera system in Nigeria is not working because the National Assembly is not able to do what they are supposed to do. If they are able to do what they are supposed to do, you find out that the regulation, the relationship that our system has created will have helped us to filter the, the, the uh, system and, and not allow things to get toxic. But because they are not doing what they are supposed to do, we get into a serious, uh, almost a serious system that we don't know what we exactly do it. At times, we accuse the, the executive of not being on seat. We accuse the executive of at times for six months. The executive is not working. And you wonder, if all Nigerians are seeing this, the legislators are supposed to checkmate the executive. What are they doing? They're doing nothing. Then there are some aspects of our constitution and, and, and practice that has issues. These issues affect nation building. Instead of looking at it and harmonizing it so that we can create the harmony to build a great nation, they are busy either partying in Dubai or any other part of the world or chasing contracts in the ministries rather than do legislation.